So DSP, aka Darkside Phil, aka Darkside Shill, this piece of garbage, puts up on his community post a friggin' Wednesday is my final consecutive streaming day this week. So he has a streaming schedule. Are you kidding me? This guy's whole life is literally YouTube playing video games and e-begging online to a bunch of virgin incels that watch his videos every single day. This is what his life is. Wednesday is my final consecutive streaming day this week. Join me for a big announcement you were asking about today on the Level 1 podcast. No one was asking you. I'll tell you all I can. Yeah, he's going to freaking... He, what he's going to say, he's going to put it behind a paywall. He's going to be like, okay, I'm going to tell you one sentence, but if I get $10 more donations, I'll tell you the second sentence. And then if I get $20 donations, I'll tell you the third sentence. That's all he's doing. Why are we giving this loser money? He's just your regular average Joe you would see on the street freaking picking up cigarette butts off the floor to smoke. There's nothing cool about DSP. There's nothing cool about watching DSP, and there's nothing cool about being DSP in a freaking fighting game tournament at EVO 2004, playing a broken port of Super Street Fighter 2 Turbo on the PlayStation, and then picking S-tier Vega as your character. There's nothing cool about that at all. Then it's more Baldur's Gate 3, exclamation mark. And of course, Sea of Stars finally continues on the late stream. Yeah, Sea of Stars. The same friggin' shovelware game which uh, Gerard the Lard friggin' got buried from and took taken out of the game. Like, look at this, guys. He makes a stream schedule. You want to talk about spamming videos? You guys want to complain about me spamming videos? All I do is 10 minutes at a time and then maybe an hour live stream on Sunday and maybe on Thursday for the Amico. That's all I do. All I do is 10 minute videos and then an hour live stream a week, right? This guy literally uploads videos like five times a day, more than 10 minutes, and then live streams throughout the whole friggin' day. Right now, I look, go to his channel, and the guy's friggin' live streaming Baldur's Gate 3. All he does is sit on the computer, edit videos, friggin' sit there, and, and, and what's this? I go to his channel, and he has the daily rap. Are, are you friggin' kidding me? The daily rap. Why the hell would I want to know this idiot's friggin' daily life and what he does and how he e-begs people? Why do I even want to know this? So you're telling me that on Thursday, he, um, okay, so on Thursday morning, he live streams, makes a video, and then Thursday night, he gives you a recap of what he just did earlier that morning, which was live stream and then make a stupid video. All right, this is his everyday daily schedule. This is doing, I'm... Like, this is the first time I'm actually going through his channel, like, looking at the videos. And this guy has 64,000 videos. <laughs> DSP. DSP Gaming YouTube channel has 64,000 videos on his YouTube channel. What planet am I on right now? 64,000. Mine... How much? How many videos do I have on my channel? And you're saying I spam videos? 628, okay? And this guy does it all friggin' day, every day, nonstop. He uses the same boring, he's too lazy to even make thumbnails. That's how garbage this guy is. He doesn't even make thumbnails. He just takes a clip. He literally takes a clip from his video and just puts the daily rap on top. Like, oh yeah, the daily, like what? The Daily Bugle, like the Spider-Man newspaper. You're the daily rap. I don't care about your pathetic life in freaking Seattle, Washington, your stupid condo that freaking Panda Lee used you for all your money and then left you in the dirt, prick. I don't care. This guy is absolutely pathetic. And then he has like, oh, date of part 28, part 29, part 30. He's just milking Baldur's Gate nonstop. He just keeps playing. All day he's on YouTube, all friggin' day. This is the same guy that started off friggin' e-begging people. He's e-begging, okay? He's he guilt trips his own friggin' audience into giving him money so that he can continue sitting in his room dwelling on the computer making videos that doesn't even take any effort you think it takes effort for me doing this crap friggin hitting record on a phone and ranting on the top of my lungs making a stupid thumbnail and putting you know it doesn't it's pretty easy actually to be honest and this guy does it and he asks you guys to pay money for him and there's people doing it what is going on in this world dark side friggin phil and then let's let's look at the comments of my last friggin video here look some guy said that um some guy said that his last post 
on the on the Patreon was like a long time ago or something. Like is, is something like that. Uh, his last post was like in November, like 2022. That's his last post on Patreon, and people are still giving him money. Look, let's go to his stupid little stream schedule. What do you have here? Oh, Wednesday, January 3rd, guys, the level one podcast. Oh my God, the level one podcast. What are you going to talk about? Your gaming knowledge sucks. You suck at games. You can't, you can't rant, okay? You have no freaking verbal skills. You have no microphone skills. You have nothing going on in your, for your life, which is interesting to me. What are you going to talk about in the level one podcast, which is somehow going to interest me into coming back for more? Nothing. Absolutely not. You're not even funny. Your jokes suck. You do racist jokes and all this crappy jokes. They're not even funny. Okay, let's see what else we got. So from 11.15 to 2.15, the level one podcast, okay? Oh, great. So great. So that's 12. Th- th- friggin' uh, how many hours is that? Three hours? Three hours of this guy talking about nonsense. Three friggin' hours of him just going on about his day. So basically, he wakes up at 10, doesn't shower, doesn't brush his teeth, eats the friggin' Slim Jim that's half open from the night before, eats that, friggin' sits his friggin' sorry carcass on the friggin' computer desk, gets the camera rolling, and starts friggin' recording himself talking for three hours, all right? And then... What, what? So he starts... Okay, so during the Level 1 podcast, he starts playing Baldur's Gate 3, and that rolls into Level 1... Like, are you... He's so lazy. Not only is he so lazy, he just rolls over the same videos and then freaking regurgitates the same content and then craps it out on YouTube. That's why he has over 64,000 videos. He does it non-stop, every single time, non-stop, all right? And then he's got Sea of Stars from 6.45 to 9.45. Can you explain one thing to me? How does he, ha- is he not supposed to be working? Is he not, so what, he just on the, his job, his daily life is YouTube and friggin' Patreon. That's how he gets friggin' paid and makes a living. That is pathetic, okay? Anyone who relies on YouTube audience to pay, to, 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 to live their life and that your whole life depends on whether a YouTube audience is behind you or not during that time is absolutely pathetic, all right? DSP, go out there and get a friggin' job. Go to Walmart and be a Walmart ge- greeter and friggin' bag groceries for all I care. This guy just th- does this nonstop. Oh, oh, look, Thursday, January 4th, a day off. Well, thank God forbid, a day off. What, what are you going to do that day, huh? Simp for women on Instagram? Is that what you're going to do? Go on Twitter and buy buy these women uh, $2 coffees and all this crap? What are you going to do on Thursday, January 4th, where you have a day off, which is so important, huh? You're probably going to go over to the friggin' un- unemployment line or maybe get your welfare check and friggin' government assistance from the friggin' whatever office that is in Seattle. Friday, January 5th, the Level 1 podcast again, and then Baldur's Gate 3 again. And then what is he doing at 6.45 like to 9.45? Friday night fights, SF6, re- oh my god, this guy just absolutely sucks. All he does is play video games, rage. And all these loser incels that are giving him Patreon money, watch this guy. There's nothing entertaining about him. The next day, again, level one podcast. How is it that you're talking every day through? Yeah, what are you doing? You're just recapping your day, what you did the day before, which people have just finished watching. Why are you recapping it? I don't want to know friggin' all the turds you taken in your stupid washroom that you didn't flush. I don't want to know how many times you didn't brush your teeth in a week. I don't want to know how smelly your condo is and it friggin' smells like friggin' cheese puffs and friggin' farts all day. I don't want to know this. Your daily life, level one podcast. Like, why? Why would I be interested in DSP's life? Why are there even people out there that are like that, okay? What I do want, you know what I do want to know about DSP? Tell me what happened with Panda Lee. Tell me those days, huh? When she was friggin' getting Tyrone in the next room and you can hear her friggin' getting Tyrone and you're sitting there in the other room friggin' on friggin' the Reddit and the internet crying on the internet, e-begging, begging people to friggin' give you money. I want to know about that story, huh? I want to know about the story where you're freaking blowing up Pandeli's phone all day saying, where are you? Where are you going? Where are you? Where are you? Why aren't you home? And she's telling you she's at her friend house. Meanwhile, she's at a freaking trap house getting re- getting a train ran on her, getting Tyrone. And then she comes home with her freaking loose clothes and you're wondering what she's doing. And she gives you a kiss on the cheek, tells you to shut up, continue e-begging so you can freaking buy her a Gucci purse, idiot. That's the story I want to know.
I want to know the story of your freaking e-begging and crying on the internet. I want to know what was going on in your mind when you're freaking making those freaking posts online saying, guys, uh, if you don't give me money, this isn't going to continue any longer. I don't want to see your content. I don't care if it doesn't continue. It's garbage content. It always was. And you're going to get continue to get exposed, you prick.